What's up everybody, Bonacute here, and welcome back to another Half-Life Modification. Today's episode is titled, Black Mesa 2009. And from the looks of it, it's gonna be a kind of a joke mod. I'm guessing it's uh, poking fun at the uh, Half-Life remake Black Mesa. So, uh, before we start this off, don't forget to check out my Half-Life Mods playlist in the description down below, as well as the Discord server. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And without further ado, let's kick this shit off and see what we're getting into. So we got two chapters to start with. We got Unforeseen Qu Consequences and Forget About Freeman. So those are the same chapter names as, of course, from Half-Life 1. You find yourself alone on a 2009 who's mutate into horrific and monsters. You must make your way to the main to Black Mesa. Holy shit, I feel like I had a stroke reading that. Okay. So... Oh my god, what's going on with my hands? Okay, I was most definitely correct in saying that this is a uh, joke mod. I'm guessing this is going to be kind of like um, the Half-Life 2 Beta Minimalist mod, but instead of Half-Life 2 Beta, it's going to be Black Mesa. That's definitely what this is looking like so far. Which, if that's the case, that's going to be fucking awesome, because <laughs> I love the Half-Life 2 Beta Minimalist mod. This is great. Damn, if headcrabs are that stupid, how does anybody become a zombie? Like, he, look at this little guy, he's trying his darndest to get that scientist, but like, the scientist dude doesn't even give a shit. He's just sidestepping that shit like a champ, okay. Anyways. Yes, that is how Black Mesa door work. Can confirm, I have Black Mesa before. Okay, so we have a dead Barney here. I see they're using the original models. Nice, nice. Okay, what's over here? Can I save the scientist, dude? Oh, shit! Oh, no! F and chat for random scientist, dude. Okay. Yes. Oh, uh, why must we wear these ridiculous ties? Okay. This is kind of out of place. Um, let's see. I know there's a vent over there, but I just want to make sure I'm checking out everything. Okay, so this is the entrance. What is this? Oh, shit! 4, 8, 15, 16, 23, 42. That's a Lost reference. Nice! I actually happen to be a big fan of Lost. And funny thing about Lost, the creators of Lost were big sh fans of Half-Life. And they even, there's even a scene from one of the episodes from Season 1 where one of the main characters is playing Half-Life 1. And also, the creators of Half-Life just so happen to be a big fan of Lost that they include a, included a Lost reference in Half-Life 2 Episode 2. That's just a little bit of uh, Lost and Half-Life uh, trivia I happen to know. <laughs> big fans of one another, so they pay tribute to each other and each other's creations. Pretty cool. Definitely, uh, if y'all are interested in uh, seeing what I mean, definitely look up uh, Half-Life slash Lost uh, Easter eggs. Okay, anyways. Really like that attention to detail. Obviously, this person knows some shit. Unless that's like a texture that's already in the Half-Life files, in which case I'm giving the uh, developer more props than is needed. Okay. I, I never thought I'd see a resonance cascade, let alone create one. Dude, we got the fucking trank, uh, what is it called? Tranquilla. What the fuck are they called? Mantriloquist? Oh shit, I don't know what the fuck they're called. The people who do puppets, that they don't move their lips and make sounds without moving their lips. This guy's the champ right here. Oh. That joke was already shit, but it was even worse because I didn't know what the name was. You know what? Fuck it. You're the only witness to my shitty joke, so you must die. God damn it, I can't even kill him. I must live with the knowledge knowing that this one man knows this shitty joke, and definitely not a bunch of other people now. Okay. Moving on. Denied. Get the fuck out of here. This is fucking awesome. <laughs> I love this. This is... Oh, there's not... I love it when these little joke mods pop up. You know? I really fucking do. Because you never expect a, j a good joke mod to just sh What is going on with the water here? Okay, that doesn't make a lot of sense. 
What the feck? Just casually defying the laws of physics here. I love how these mods just show up, though. Like, there's... I mean, I guess that's true of, of everything, really. But, like, I never suspect joke mods. And then, boom. They just randomly pop up. Like, Gas Mask Citizen 21. I never knew anything about that until it literally just cropped up on ModDB. And likewise with this one. Like, I'm not going to say... I'm not... Oh, okay. We're suddenly in the back rooms. I'm not saying this is as good as Gas Mask Citizen 21. But... I mean, it's pretty fucking entertaining in a stupid way. I mean, it is a joke mod. Gordon, oh, I know it was you. I let you in. Everyone's heading for the service. But I think they're crazy not to stay put. Someone is bound to come by and rescue us. Alrighty. This is definitely, in, in my opinion, hands down, way better than the Black Mesa remake we got. Fuck that version. This is all we need, guys. Way better. Best, best version of, uh, hell, it's even better than the original Half-Life. I, there, I said it. I fucking said it. Better than Half-Life 1, better than Black Mesa. This mod is where it's at. I'm not sure what a fucking zombie is doing here, but alright, I'll, I'll take it. I really hope the guy who's developing this plans on finishing it, or at least releasing more versions, because I must see the end of this. I must see what his, what his incarnation of the, um, fuck man. Oh hey, it's, it's G-Man. Sup G-Man, what's up, dog? Oh my god, and that's what the turret looks like. Amazing. But I must see what his, what his, um, version of the, uh, the Gonark and the fucking, um, Nihilinth looks like. I must see. Okay. Whatever it is, I'm sure it'll be nothing short of amazing. G-Man, you still chilling there? Alright, cool. Okay then. Just watching from afar, the creeper peeper that he is, probably probably jerking it. Okay. Okie dokie. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, I'm in a pickle now! Oh fuck! Oh, you kinda, you kinda boned yourself there, buddy. You probably shouldn't have done that. What the fuck? What, what the fuck's going on here? This is weird. Man, 10 out of 10 gameplay, you guys. The action is just, oh! It's got me on the edge of my seat. Holy shit. This shit is so intense. Oh god, look at all the soldier guys over here. Oh, oh I might be done for you guys. Oh shit. Wow, that was just thrilling. Oh shit, there's more. Oh fuck, oh fuck! Ah! That was a close one. Man, this is just 10 out of 10 action. It's so fucking thrilling, you guys. Again, just mwah, much better than that shitty Black Mesa remake we got. Oh my god. Don't even get me started on that. This is where it's at, boys and girls. This is where it's fucking at. This is, it's so accurate and just, and just true to Half-Life 1, is it not? I, I defy anybody to say otherwise. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. I'm really digging the, uh, the old piss-colored glass. It's a nice touch. Oh no! 
Okay, how am I supposed to... Okay, I hope this guy's got some mad hops. I hope this version of Gordon Freeman has... Okay, yeah, he's, yeah, he's good. Oh, I was probably supposed to jump to that. Oh, well, this works too. Oh. And you know what I appreciate about this? Is that it just cuts out a lot of the bullshit. It really does. Like, you know, I always thought, you know, Half-Life 1, it's just way too long. This, it just really, you know, it cuts to the point. We start off after Resonance Cascade. The first chapter is like literally less than five minutes long. I mean, we're really humming along, you guys. That's great. I think that's awesome. Okay. Um, oh, there's more? Oh, yeah. what the fuck is this? Why is my... Why do I got the fucking death, death claw right here, going on here? I look like I'm about to go and kick... Kung Fu kick somebody's ass. Give them the old five-fingered death punch. Um, but seriously, why are my fucking grenades invisible? What's going on? Okay. What was the point of even coming over here? Oh, secret area? Okay. Well, I got more grenades out of that. That's nice. Fuck. I way over, way overshot that. Oh god. I don't even, why am I even... Oh. Why the fuck did I even bother? Honestly. Why the fuck did I even bother doing that? I so could have just walked by that and been totally okay. Okay. Open. Says a me. Hello. Barney. Uh, you, uh, you good? What that mouth do? No. Um. Man, am I glad to see you. I was worried you wouldn't make it. Anyway, listen. You've got HEV suits to protect you. If I go down there, those soldiers will kill me. And I'll follow you. <laughs> okay. Alrighty then. Cool. Nice chat. I got HEV suits that protect me. Multiple HEV suits. I am double wrapped, you guys. fuck is Barney? Barney, get your ass back here, you bitch. Ba Yo! Yo, Barney. Barnold, come on. The fuck, dog? Okay, I guess he's not following me. It says C squad following. Does the C stand for cunt? Because he's a lying cunt. He's not following me even though he said he was going to. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Doesn't bother running. Just fucking... Bites the dust like nothing, okay. Okay. Oh, hello. Alrighty, um, is this the end? I think that's the end. Oh wait, no, there's but wait, there's more. Oh shit, is this gonna be the entire mod? Ladies and gents, this is gonna be the entire mod. Holy shit. I might have to make this a multi-parter. This is fantastic. Oh my god, you guys. This is incredible. I'm loving it! Just like Half-Life! Can we, can we make this baby go faster? Come on! Damn! I'm just blowing these fools away! Look at this! Just wasting these fuckers! Whoosh! Whoa! You thought? Bah! Okay. Alright. Uh, grenades? No, uh, no grenades. Okay, shit. Alright! That was fucking dope. I'm wasting these assholes. Okay. 
push the button. Oh shit, okay, I thought my cart was gonna run away without me. Yeah, run that fucker over, come on. Come on, oh shit, it ends here, god damn it, I really wanted to run that dude over. Yo, what are y'all shooting at? What's going on up there, huh? Oh, hey! What the fuck? I thought y'all were shooting at something else. I thought we were gonna have a, a bonding moment. I thought, you know, you'd shoot at the same thing as I'm shooting at, and we just, you know, we'd become best bros. What the fuck were they shooting at up there? Okay. Oh wait, were they shooting at G-Man? There's G-Man again. Fucking creep. Ah, you like the show? You like the show, G-Man? You like me strutting my ass? For you to watch? Damn, this is a powerful shotgun. Literally shooting straight through fucking solid concrete. I have grenade. This is perfect opportunity for grenade. <laughs> that was perfect. Perfect timing. All right. Next chapter. Come on. We are just fucking breezing through through this shit, y'all. Is that a hunter? I could have sworn I heard a hunter. Ugh. This pistol's kind of shite. Oh yeah, it's machine gun time, bitches. What difficulty am I playing on? Uh, anyways. Okay, it's normal. These guys are pretty fucking easy to kill. Okay. Okay, I hear a hunter around here somewhere. Kind of interested to see what it actually is, because I'm sure they didn't just put a hunter in this shit. Okay, let's go check it out. It's probably no, it's a hunter. What the fuck? Okay, that's a little lazy. I would have thought they'd like at least change the skin to like a gargantua or some shit. But okay, okay, so there's hunters in Black Mesa now. That is now officially canon. I'm accepting it, you guys. I don't see any problems with that. I mean, I'm sure we can figure out a way to work that into the war, right? Okay, I'll be taking your shit now. Thank you, thank you. Oh, wow, look at that planet. Holy shit. It looks very, uh, very much like, you know, the actual Earth. Okay. Is it possible to go into these buildings? No, it doesn't look like it. Moving on. Can I go this way? No. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Uh, this glass always chips me up because I never, never know I'm coming up on it. Can I break these crates? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Uh, what the fuck is this? Okay. What does this button do? Yes, let's just push the ominously glowing red button. Okay, uh, it actually does nothing. It's a troll button. You think it does something, but it does nothing. Okay, moving on. What the fuck? Maybe it did do something? What the hell? Okay, it must have done something, right? Let's go back. Um. Oh shit! Hey, what's up, homies? Bye bye. Okay. Oh shit! Wait, why would I need another HEV suit? Don't I already have one? Also, what is up with that texture? It's <laughs> very HD, HD HEV suit. If you know what I'm saying? Okay. Wait, so I'm not going to get the HEV suit. But I want it! Mom! I want the HEV suit! No, honey, we have HEV suit at home. HEV suit at home. Okay, uh, so we're not going this way. So let's go back. Oh, it opened a thing over here. Did it open a thing over here? 
No. Oh, maybe it opened that door at the end of the hall over here. That's kind of weird. Wouldn't you think that the door, to, the button to open this door would... Wait, no, I already... What the fuck, you guys? I'm already... I'm already lost in this place. So, that button opens this thing. And the button in here opened what? What the fuck? Okay, I'm gonna go back. Um, kind of confused. Like, okay. Can I do something over here now? Can I go th Wait, what the fuck? Uh, oh, okay, so I opened the door here. I'm a dumbass. Hey, buddy, I think you dropped this. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You got nothing. Hey, buddy. That's for you. I think your buddy wanted you to have it. Man, why do y'all keep denying the gifts I give y'all? You assholes. So unappreciative. Oh, this guy's really fascinated by this head crab. Let's examine it together. Oh, shit, what the fuck? God, I thought... Dude, I thought we were having, like, a bro moment. I thought we were bonding over the... Our mutual, uh... Enjoyment we take from watching head crabs. I don't fucking know. Um... Okay. What did these do? There's so many just random fucking buttons. Black Mesa, I mean, dude, the designer of Black Mesa must have been hella fucking either stoned or drunk because he puts the buttons to open doors literally nowhere near the fucking door. Like, how does anybody supposed to navigate their way around this shit? Like, I really sincerely hope they fired this asshole. Like, why would the door to be, why would the button to be, to open this door be in this room? Why not just right here? Okay. Hey, now I'm up here. Okay, cool. Yes, combine posters. That makes sense. You dick! You dick! Get your hands off me! Okay. Thus concludes another level. Forget about Freeman. Man, we were just humming along to the story, aren't we? Holy shit! I just totally, totally missed. Hey, uh, dude, there's like a... Wait, are the hunters and soldiers on the same side? Hold on. Hold the phone. This doesn't make much sense. Okay, that's a thing, I guess. Interesting. I don't understand. Where are the alien grunts? And the Vortigaunts. They could have at least put Vortigaunts in this, right? Vortigaunts are, I mean, like, already in the game, aren't they? Okay. Uh, anyways. Ah, oh, head itch. Okay. Well, at least we got the classic uh, head crabs in the air duct section. I mean, it's not Half-Life 1 without that, am I right? Hey, uh, guys, I think you dropped this. <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay. You're taking that, thank you. I guess we're going over here now. This is fucking glorious, you guys. This is, I know I've said it probably enough by now, but god damn. Such a beautiful and accurate um, adaptation of, of Half-Life, truly. Developer, I, I applaud you. Okay, so I opened that thing. Wait, was that already open? I don't fucking know, you guys. I'm barely paying attention. I'm just so struck by the beauty of this mod. I must have blown that guy up so hard that he flew right to the door. What the fuck? Okay. Okay. 
Man, this is fucking awesome, you guys. Oh shit. Oh god. Gordon may have met his match, you guys. Going on in here. Okay, I guess uh, time to face the hunter. Where the f uh, uh, hello, hunter? Uh, uh, what? Um, okay, I guess he. Uh, uh, I guess he's gone now. Oh shit! There you are. What the fuck? Okay. Hi. Why are you not dead yet? God damn. You, sir, were quite the pain in the ass to kill. Okay. Okay, don't don't mind me while I guzzle some health juice. All right, um, moving on. This way? No. The fuck? The layout of this fucking facility is so, so trippy. Okay, so here's the rocket. Oh, I want to launch the rocket. Let me launch the rocket. Man. How do I launch it? Am I not there yet? Maybe I'm not there yet. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? Two hours later. I kind of got a little stuck. I couldn't figure out how to get to the next level. And I still couldn't figure out how to do that. So I just said fuck it and loaded the next map manually. Mod developer, if you are watching this, please tell me how to fix, how, do I, how the fuck I was supposed to do that. Because I couldn't figure it out for the life of me. But uh, yeah. I don't know why whenever I spawn in I have an invisible hand grenade, but that's pretty fucking dope. Okay, so I hear a hunt door. Are you taking that? Thank you. Alright, where's this hunter bitch at? Let's go, buddy. You and me, let's dance. Wait, what the fuck? Okay. This glass is always such a fucking trip. I never know that it's there until it's, well, there. Like, look at this shit. How is anybody supposed to know that there's a, a layer of glass there? Okay. You're taking that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Okay, um... What did that do? I guess that opened the store. Again, uh, these buttons are really fucking confusing, you guys. How are you not dead, you bitch? Fucking die! Oh my god! Yeah, this hunter can take a kick and keep on licking, I guess. Or however the fuck that expression goes. Most likely said that wrong. Okay. I can't get up there. Oh, Jesus, another fucking hunter. All right. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, come on, buddy. Quit sticking around. Let's go. Everybody's throwing grenades. Too many grenades going around, you guys. Okay. Now where do I go? Okay, I guess that's the end. <laughs> if I'm not mistaken, there's not that many chapters left. In fact, this may be the final episode, ladies and gentlemen. I know, I know. A shame. This mod could go on forever, and I'd, I'd be quite happy. 
This is truly a masterpiece of, of modern modern source modding, isn't it? But unfortunately, as all good things must, it is slowly but surely coming to its end. See, so yes, here's the this is the what's it, the Lambda Complex? Is that the name of the chapter? I forget what the title. I don't. I don't know. I don't remember what all the title names were. I'm gonna be completely honest. There's a lot of chapter names. Okay. Don't know why I'm using my Glock. Rocking out with my Glock out, I guess. Okay. So that's one button. Should be another button in here. Okay. See, so you guys, the layout, I mean, the layout is almost just identical to Half-Life 1's layout. Like, I cannot, I cannot point out any, any way in which it, it differs, truly. It is pretty fucking accurate. Okay, that should be enough air. Let's roll. Oh, God. Maybe I shouldn't sprint underwater. That's right. You know, sprinting usually uh, consumes a little bit of oxygen, doesn't it? Okay, Gordon does not know how to use ladders. Up, up, and away! Okay. Oh god. Oh fuck, 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 fuck! He's not ready for- Oh tits. Damn it. Are you shitting me? Are you fucking for real? God damn it. Now we're back at the beginning, of course. Okay. Just cause of that one fucking asshole. I could have avoided that grenade too, but another grenade blew up and it and sent it hurtling in my direction. That was some bullshit. Man, fuck the fuck physics. Okay. Fuck this game's physics anyways. Let's go ahead and drop a save there. Come on. Come on, Gordo, swim a little faster. You're gonna have to dog pedal a little faster than that, buddy. Come on! Stop humping the ladder. No time for that. Come on, hump, hump later. You're gonna hump your heart out as soon as we're through this shit, man, but we gotta, we gotta get through here. People, people trying to kill our asses. Some people don't accept, accept your ladder fetish. Okay. All right, here we go. Oh, what the fuck? Um. Okay. And now we're in Zen, I presume. Okay. I don't know what the fuck happened there. Oh, is this? So we meet at last. We're like skipping a lot. In the flesh, I do hope you understand. Stand part. I cannot close my report until every loose end has been tied up. The biggest embarrassment has been Black Mesa facility. The border world, Zen, is in our control for the time being, thanks to you. While I believe a civil servant like yourself understands the importance of discretion. My employers are not quite so trusting, and rather than continually subject you to the irresistible human temptation of telling all, we have decided to convey you somewhere you can do no possible harm, and where no harm can come to you. I'm sure you can imagine there are worse alternatives. Okay. Well, it looks like we won't be working together. Oh, what a shame. Oh, I didn't get an option? Well, that's kind of jacked. Ah, thank God, I'm off night. I'm safe, Gordon. Okay, and thus concludes Half-Life Black Mesa 2009. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I've said it once and I'll say it yet again. This, my friends, is quite possibly the best adaptation of the Half-Life storyline. Fuck Black Mesa, 
Black Mesa source, that is. Black Mesa 2009 is where it is at, ladies and gentlemen. If you want to experience the Half-Life storyline anew or for the first time, definitely check out this mod today. Link is in the description down below. And so I do hope y'all enjoyed. And if you did, hey, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Helps your guy out quite a bit. Hoping to get this channel to a thousand. That is my current goal. And I would really appreciate. In fact, I would absolutely love you if you could help me reach that goal. And, uh... Yeah, that's where I'm going to end this. <laughs> so, bye-bye.